poised overhead like some fantastic prehistoric predator is an installation with a very important job. The large-scale track sprayer at Sion in Rotorua, New Zealand is a clever machine that has been designed and built to optimise pesticide spraying for weed and disease control. Senior scientist Stefan Gauss has been involved with the project from day one. Stefan, how much pesticide would the forest industry use in a year? Forestry uses approximately 450 tonnes of active ingredient annually. In radiata plantation forestry, the main weeds that we deal with are exotics, buglia, broom, gorse, pampas and a little bit of blackberry. How can forestry and other New Zealand primary industries reduce the amount of pesticides they use? Well, pesticide usage can be reduced in a number of ways. The best way to go about it is to ensure that we apply the correct pesticides at the most applicable rates to achieve the biological outcome. The main issue is when it comes to accuracy is to literally place the active ingredient where it's intended and minimizing the risk of drift to reduce the volume of pesticides used and also to use the most benign pesticide to achieve the biological outcome. What is Scion doing about this? From the Scion's view, there is a drive to develop accurate models that can predict where aerial spraying is deposited. The main driver behind the models, as I've said, is the use of field data and this is something that we at Scion have approached in a new environment in developing the track sprayer where field data is very much prone to the ambient weather conditions and therefore you need lots of data to develop accurate models. Whereas in the track sprayer where we are attempting to upscale from a tiny track sprayer, we've gone to developing this very large facility. So the scaling is more appropriate and the track sprayer allows us to conduct the research under totally controlled environments where we can change single inputs at a time. What is so special about the Scion track sprayer facility? The, the main advantage of this new facility is the f pure physical size of it. This facility allows a work area of 12 square meters. So the, the size of the facility, the speed at which the boom can run, and the simulated uh, application that we do, simply allows us to upscale to the more realistic plant sizes of up to two meter tall trees as opposed to little seedlings. So it, it all comes back to the scale of the facility, the speed at which we can run and what type of simulations we can do. And because it is contained, we can use pesticides in a totally safe environment as well. Scion's precision track sprayer is an invaluable tool for scientists like Stefan. By running more realistic spray deposition experiments in controlled situations, he and others can refine and optimise their plans before moving to expensive field trials. The ultimate goal of focusing on spray technology is to reduce the amount of pesticides used in New Zealand and protect people and the environment from unnecessary exposure. The track sprayer is available for use for any work that involves controlled droplet deposition, whether it's for forestry, agriculture or horticulture, or applying treatments to wood and other materials.